Fall is officially here, and there's something about the changing seasons that feels like a natural reset to me. Along with the crisp air, cozy vibes, and the way everything slows down a little, it's the perfect time to refocus and get back into healthy routines. I always find that as summer fades, I feel more motivated to reflect, re-energize, and really commit to new habits that support my wellness. I love being intentional with my mornings, so today I want to take you through my fall morning routine. These little rituals help me to start the day feeling grounded, energized, and clear-headed. I love waking up early to get a head start on the day and make time for myself whether it's focusing on wellness, productivity, or self-care. This routine is all about setting myself up for fulfilling and productive days as we transition into this new season. So if you're feeling like you need a reset too, I hope this inspires you to create your own fall routine that you'll love and cherish for this upcoming season. After waking up, the first thing I do is let in some natural light. There's something about soft morning sunlight that really helps set a positive tone for the day. I'm also really going to miss being able to wake up with the sun because dark winter mornings are coming soon. So I like to appreciate little things like this when I can and be present. I love to make my bed first thing in the morning. It's a small thing that puts me in a productive mindset for the day. Next step in my routine is hydrating. I always start with trying to chug as much of my water bottle as I can to rehydrate after sleeping. I also try to do this before I drink my coffee so I at least have something somewhat hydrating beforehand. I love to make myself a warm drink, usually a decaf coffee, and right now I've been loving the fall oat milk for my latte. It's so delicious. It's such a calming way to wake up my body and ease into the morning and I love sipping a hot fall latte. As someone who struggles with anxiety, I found that waking up with mindfulness and meditation makes a huge difference. That's why I've integrated Aura into my daily routine, and it has become an essential part of how I kick off my mornings. Most mornings, I struggle with waking up stressed and anxious from the weight of the day ahead. Since I started using Aura, it has completely transformed my morning routine, helping me to clear my mind, having a moment to myself, and prepare for a productive day ahead. Aura is an all-in-one mindfulness and sleep app that has been trusted by over 7 million people and has even won the Best of Apple Award. What makes Aura stand out is its high level of personalization. Using AI and billions of data points, it tailors content specifically for you. Whether it's meditations, stress relief, or daily mindfulness, from the moment you set up your account, Aura curates content that matches your preferences, making it easy to find exactly what you need without endless scrolling. One of my favorite morning meditations on Aura is Morning Priming for Gratitude by Cass Carlopio. It helps me set positive intentions for the day and shake off any lingering stress from the night. I've also been loving the Wake Up Well morning meditation series by mindfulness coach Jennifer Luis. It gives me that gentle nudge to start the day with positivity. If you're looking to transform your mornings and find more balance, I highly recommend Aura. You can try it for free with the link in my description and the first 500 people will also get 25% off their subscription. Movement is a non-negotiable for me, especially in the morning. Although I haven't been as consistent as I once was, I want to take this new season to turn a new leaf and start getting back in the gym five mornings a week. I love working out in the morning because it helps me wake up, boost my energy throughout the day, and I just love the way that it makes me feel. Accomplished, happy, endorphins rushing, and I'm the type of person that needs that first thing. Today, I'm doing a quick at-home workout. I have been loving these for busy days, and on days when I have more time, I've been loving to lift and run to get my heart rate pumping.
Getting ready for the day is my favorite part of the day. It's like my little act of self-care. Depending on the day, I will either hop in the shower to rinse off or on days like today where I'm not too sweaty, I like to just do a quick morning skincare routine. With the cooler weather, I've been focusing on hydration and keeping my skin protected. I'm really intentional about using clean, non-toxic products that nourish my skin and I've been absolutely loving all things Primally Pure. Their skincare is just so amazing, my skin is super dry and I tend to have acne prone skin and their products have been amazing going into this fall time. Like I said, I love to use this time in the morning as a small act of self-care that always makes me feel refreshed and ready for the day. A few non-negotiables for me are ice rolling and my gua sha. My face feels depuffed and I feel like it helps my skincare sink into my skin better. Alongside my skincare is my oral care routine that I don't take lightly. This is because I believe that gut health starts in the mouth and we want to get rid of all of that bacteria as soon as we wake up. First things first is flossing. I love using the picks because they're easy for me to use and help me to stay consistent. I use an electric toothbrush. It makes my mouth feel so much cleaner than a regular one. I will then take my tongue scraper and this is going to get all of that bacteria out of your mouth and off your tongue. Last but certainly not least, I like to oil pull. This also reduces the amount of bacteria and can help a lot with gum health. After finishing my skincare and oral care routine, I move on to my makeup routine. I like to keep it pretty simple, focusing on keeping everything light and breathable, especially as the weather gets cooler and the air gets drier here in Utah. Again, I like to prioritize clean, non-toxic makeup products, and most days I won't even wear makeup. If I'm not wearing makeup, like today, I will go in with my Elastin Tinted Sunscreen, curl my lashes, I love to use this Ilia Eyebrow Gel, Say Blush and Bronzer, and Summer Friday's Lip Balm. Since switching to cleaner products and not wearing makeup every day, my acne has pretty much cleared up, so I love to keep it simple and try to enhance my natural features more than anything. It also saves me so much time, less than five minutes, it's quick and easy to apply, and I feel good in my skin and put together for the rest of the day. Refueling my body first thing in the mornings, especially after a workout, are very important to me. I like to make a simple, high-protein, and nourishing breakfast. Lately, I've been loving making eggs and beef sausages with avocado toast. But today, we are switching it up and we're making a delicious goat cheese omelet with a side of fresh sourdough toast. I like to use bell peppers, sausages, red onion, goat cheese, and two eggs. I always top it with some hot sauce and fresh dill. I am a savory girl when it comes to breakfast and I normally don't reach for things like oatmeal or yogurt. I try to shoot for 30 to 40 grams of protein to start my morning off. I love how eating like this makes me feel and it helps me maintain my energy and focus throughout the day. Now that I'm ready for the day, it's time to get organized. I always start by writing out my to-do list for the day. Normally, if I'm doing really well with my routines, I will already have some sort of to-do list written from the night before. I like to just go back through, add anything, or move anything around that I feel like is a higher priority for the day. This is my favorite step in my morning routine because it helps me feel clear-headed and prepares me for a productive day. Sometimes I'll light a candle or make some tea to set a relaxing tone while I do this. Today, it was a spend drift. Being in intentional with my time is key and I love the feeling of crossing things off as I go. Once my list is set, I'm ready to jump into work mode. One of my favorite tips for jumping into work and not getting distracted is turning your phone on work mode or airplane mode and leaving it a little out of reach. I find that this makes me the most productive and I can easily sit at my computer for hours at a time and get really good productive work done. wraps up my fall morning routine. 
I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me and maybe even got some inspiration for your own routines. As the seasons change, it's such a great time to reflect and reset, and this routine really helps me feel grounded and prepared for the day ahead. If you're looking to establish healthier habits or just find a little more balance in your mornings, I highly encourage you to start small and see what feels good for you. Thank you so much for watching and let me know in the comments what your favorite morning rituals are for fall. I'd love to hear them. Until next time, have an amazing day and I'll see you in my next video.